Also scary, dangerous, and downright unsafe. And that is how Logan County drivers are describing this bridge they have to drive over almost every day. News Force Kaylee Olivas is back in Logan County tonight with details. Well, the bridge you can see behind me here on Triplet Road in southern Logan County may look undamaged, but as you take a look down, you can see the ground beneath this bridge. This hole that he just popped out of, it's about two feet wide. Residents nearby say this road needs to be fixed right away. You just gotta like steer really well and hope you don't fall to the side because it's just so narrow. And that's how Stephanie says she drives over this bridge daily. In the car, you can feel every bump. It's when you step outside of the car that you can see ruts, potholes, and even gaping holes. Those holes don't look to have any support underneath either, giving bystanders a look 10 feet down to the ground below. There isn't a sign in sight warning drivers of the damage, though. Well, I really don't even want to go that way now, so oh, man. thanks for telling me. Yeah. She's hoping she'll one day be able to drive over it again without fear or concern looming in the back of her mind. For that to happen, though, she says the county needs to repair it. I've made several phone calls. My mom's made several phone calls to get them out here to fix it. All the roads out here are awful. But sadly, her mom says the bridge has been this way for a while. When News 4 spoke with Logan County Commissioner Marvin Goodman October 31st, he said, quote, even though I have only eight weeks left in office, I am very interested in hearing and addressing any safety issues between now and December 31st. So we reached out to him Friday afternoon about the safety concern of the bridge. He did reply, but only with a single letter. He didn't address anything that was brought up. In Logan County, Kaylee Olivas, Oklahoma's News 4. All right, Kaylee, thank you. Now, this is the fourth area of southern Logan County we've looked at in just the last three weeks. If you're having issues with your road, send an email to the KFOR team.